YouTube salute. Jake Bug's first love and hip hop reunion was packed with drama, mainly because he had some harsh words for Little Fizz and April Jones. If you don't know by now, April Jones um, heard and Omarion broke up and she hooked up with Little Fizz. And it's some crazy, you know, stupid shenanigan shit going on. So things escalated when Bug asked how he would feel if Little Fizz dated his baby's mother. Fizz is, you know, like I said, dating Omarion's baby mother, April Jones. And he quickly replied, I'm going to fuck him up. Then he slammed April Jones, saying it was wrong for her to have a relationship with Little Fizz. After having to um, having kids with his close friend Omarion. What's fucked up is it's unfortunate that you fucked with his brother before you fucked with him. Damn. April then threatened to spill some information about Bug, and he responded with, Open up the box then, baby. Trust me. I ain't the one to fuck with. Do you want me to say it? Or so I can, so you your, um, your clip is empty? Jones then said that there were other relationships happening with members, other family members. It appeared April was claiming that Bug had a relationship with someone, family members in B2K. Um, also, if you didn't know, there's a video circulating around April Jones cheating on Little Fizz, and I guess they might be breaking up because she hooked up with um, FGB Baby Goat. They got a picture of them in a club, and they hugged up and kissing and shit. And FGB Baby Goat hit his Instagram saying this, Man, keep my name out y'all blogs and keep y'all bitches on a leash. Orange mound shit, FBG. Oh, shit. Damn, so motherfucker letting that shit be known. So let me give you my intake. I'm not mad for Bug for saying that shit about I'm going to fuck his ass up because honestly, Little Fizz, that was some punk ass shit what he did. For real, that was some punk ass shit what he did. And nobody liked that shit, for real. Like, I was in a situation before one of my ex-homeboys did that shit. He did that shit right when I broke up with my ex-girlfriend when it was completely over. He didn't wait not even a week to go do that. And then he thought it was cool when he saw me. Like, nigga, fuck you. I don't fuck with you like that no more. Bitch, keep your motherfucking distance from me. For real. Go over there somewhere. Don't fuck with the champion. Not me. And then she tried to sit here and say, we were never real friends and this and this. Same thing this bitch April Jones doing. She said the same exact thing. And this nigga trying to say like, oh, I don't know what nobody talking about. I don't know what nobody talking about. Now they broke up. The nigga was cheating on her. That nigga had sex. That nigga had sex with her mother and her homegirl. So she looks, he looks stupid. She looks stupid. Like I said, little Fizz, I knew this shit wasn't going to last long. Come on, y'all. If April Jones, she's a fucking thought. She's out there. Come on, if you left, if you and your um your ex husband or not just ex husband, your child's father, y'all broke up. I, I'm sorry that happened, but if you left him and you hooked up with his one of his tightest friends and then you try to deny that it was never that tight, that's stupid as fuck. They were tight. They was on a fucking. They was in a music group together. You're going to get tight. So what motherfuckers in a music group goes to the studio, work out together, you know, um, you know, do the dance rehearsals. You on tour, you going around the world, you're doing interviews, and you're not gonna be tight. So you just so after you do your your um your session in the studio, you go straight to your hotel. Get the fuck out of here. It don't even make sense. You can't bullshit a bullshit and you're not gonna bullshit me. So I'm glad um Jay Boog said that shit. Y'all wanna fuck his ass up too. Don't get mad at that shit because the motherfuckers speaking real. They want these people to fucking tuck their goddamn tail. No, it's some alpha men around this motherfucker. And we're gonna strut our stuff. Because motherfuckers ain't scared of everybody around this motherfucker. Right is right and wrong is wrong. And April Jones, she's the thought of 2019. Maybe the fucking thought of 2010 to 2019, the fucking decade thought. That's how I'm looking at it. And you know, Little Fizz, you know, I'm surprised Marion didn't whoop his motherfucking ass. Marion should have put hands on that motherfucker. But, you know, Marion was on Vlad TV. He said, I ain't worried about it. It is what it is. For sure. It is what it is. Let him feel that way. I ain't mad at him. He feeling that way, but everybody's different and everybody going to handle the situation different. Post your comments below. Hulk smash Black Panther the like button. Subscribe to my channel. Click the bell icon to be notified when I upload new content and go live. 
If you'd like to support and donate to the channel, I have Venmo, Cash App, PayPal, Streamlabs, everything's in the description. Until next time, peace.